Dr. Ku, this is going to be a great conversation because we're going to talk about chronic venous insufficiency called CVI for short, very often. And you said it's extremely underdiagnosed and unrecognized. Yeah, so I'm gonna talk to you about what CVI is first. So it stands for chronic venous insufficiency. And chronic means that it takes a long time to occur. And the opposite word is acute. Acute means like a acute appendicitis, it happens within like one to two days. Mm -hmm. And it happens a long time. And venous, because we're talking about vein system, not the arterial system. And I'll talk to you about the circulation first. And the insufficiency means leaky valve, and we'll go over that. Is it just something that's kind of unsightly, or is this painful for people? Yeah, pain is one of the main features of it. However, there are a lot of features and symptoms that are uh, out there, and then people are suffering from it, but but they don't recognize it. For example, night light, night cramps that they're suffering and it's interrupting their sleep, but they are contributing as, oh, maybe it's a muscle. And then they wake up every night because of that cramps, but soon after the vein treatment, it can improve. This gentleman is 70 year old male with very active lifestyle. And he presented with a knee pain. A lot of people, when they think about the knee pain, they're thinking about arthritis or neuropathy, and he got all the workup done it came out normal he noticed that the only thing that kind of he can think about was multiple varicose vein around the knee area so I treated his varicose vein very aggressively it took him about three months to finish all the treatment and then he got amazing results as you can see here he's pain free and then the, the, the other amazing thing about his treatment and recovery was he lost two pounds just losing the fluid out of from his leg this next question that I'm going to ask sounds kind of silly because I'm going to say, how do you diagnose it? But you walked into our green room, full disclosure, and you said, you've got CVI. <laughs> I have a magic eye. Yeah. How is it diagnosed? Uh, yeah. So the diagnosis is done by the ultrasound, mm -hmm. and it's a gold standard meaning that that's the best way to diagnose the vein disease. However, it, it is very specialized. You have to be specific for where you're scanning at. And then our venous ultrasound techs are specializing the vein system. Okay, well we actually have a little testimonial from a vein treatment clinic patient of yours. Let's see what she had to say about her experience. I stopped hiking, my legs felt very full all the time. Um, it was uncomfortable and painful. I was always in pain. I noticed that Dr. Ku was straightforward and honest and explained how she's going to fix this and why it's happening. Because so many years people have told me, I'm sorry, there's nothing you can do. When she said, I can fix this and make your life better, and I'm so happy that I've done this, it's changed my life. So she's in 60s and she gained so much weight and she had a lot of uh, vein, uh, visible veins and she was very depressed about it. And after I treated her, she was very active and she lost 35 pounds and she's skateboarding in 60s. Uh -huh. Yeah, and she found new love. Oh, yeah, wow. the after vein treatment, she opened her new chapter of her life. All right, wonderful. Well, uh, based on our conversation, it sounds like I might become one of those before <laughs> and yeah. after. Thank and you. <laughs> what I do differently than other academic center is I do the um, medical and cosmetic treatment. So if you have both concerns, I want to feel better, but at the same time, I, I want to look better, then you want to seek a treatment center that offers both services. Yeah, so I do that, and one thing that I stand out the most is the skincare after the treatment. So soon after the treatment, you're gonna have a little bit of uh, hyperpigmentation or a little bit of bruising, and some of those patients who came here with the skin discoloration, and we call it hyperkeratosis, very dry skin because of vein disease, they need special uh, skin treatment, and I guide them uh, step by step. 